Joe from Joe's Butcher Shop and we're here today to talk about buying whole pieces of meat versus buying individual steaks and how you can make that happen. We've got a great spot on our website that shows this in pictures and in dollars and hope you appreciate a little education. We have in front of us three pieces of, of meat here. On the top we've got our whole New York strip loin. In the center we have a whole boneless pork loin and here closer to me we have a whole bone-in rib loin. When you buy steaks individually at your butcher uh, you're going to pay a, a full price because this is a full trimmed steak as you can see we have the silver trimmed off the top we have a very thin fat cap beautifully trimmed all the way around and you're going to pay a pre premium price for this steak. When you buy the whole piece of meat uh, in this particular case a New York strip loin will weigh somewhere between 10 and 13 pounds uh, you get a tremendous discount. Now there's going to be some loss of trim involved with this and, and here's how you make everything work out. If you are buying this steak at X dollars you will buy a whole loin at X minus some percent. Uh, basically what you have to, to, to figure out and calculate is can I buy the whole piece of meat at a price such that if I lose about 20% to trim that it's less still than the price of this individual steak. Now we here at Joe's always make sure it works to our customers advantage. You always save money by buying whole pieces of meat. We trim a whole piece of meat for you, uh, cut it and trim it to your specifications. We then will pack it to your specifications even if it's individually wrapped. So that's it's a great thing. Ask your butcher to do it for you. I have another example here in the center of a, a whole boneless pork loin. We're talking about nine pounds of meat here. The type of things that you get from it typically are uh, an America's chop, which is a boneless pork chop, or we can butterfly it. We can also turn this into roasts for you, or you can have any combination. So there's another advantage of buying whole pieces of meat is that you can get combinations. We could take this particular cut cut it in half, take the back half and make a roast for you. We could make several America's chops and we could give you butterfly chops all in one piece. So it's, it's a real bargain. As we move now to our bone-in cuts, you start to get with some heavier pieces of meat because of the bone. This particular uh, bone-in rib weighs anywhere from 15 to 20 pounds, so it's going to be a bit more expensive and a bigger investment for you. But again, the advantages of it are less expensive than buying individual steaks like this beautiful bone-in ribeye. Again, we can cut it into roasts if you're looking for a prime rib roast. This is the way to go, especially if you've got to feed a large group. Go ahead and get a full loin. We can cut whatever roast you like from it, and the rest we can cut in steaks. We can individually cryovac them for you, individually freezer wrap them. All in all, a great bargain. Again, go to joesbutchershop.com, click on the whole loin tab, and we've got a lot more information and graphics and pictures to help you through this process. It's a great way to save money, doesn't take a lot of room in your freezer, and is really good in these times.